Good morning. My name is Bob McKay and I'm one of the co-founders of AgriDigital alongside Ben Reid and Emma Weston. Between us we've got over 80 years of experience in agricultural supply chain ranging from farming right through the supply chain to exporting uh, various commodities. We've, uh, we founded and operated Australia's largest grower grain marketing organisation, which was later sold to a US uh, cooperative. We founded uh, Australia's first and possibly the world's first online physical grain marketplace uh, that was later on sold to the New Zealand Stock Exchange. So we understand the agri supply chain very well, but importantly, as founders, we're all still farmers. We all still farm grain. Not much this year, as you can imagine, but we still do. Um, so we understand it very well from start to finish. And we also understand the problems that are inherent in the supply chain. <clears throat> Personally, over the years, I've, I've sold grain as a farmer and as a trader to buyers who've become insolvent before I've been paid, costing me personally hundreds of thousands of dollars. In 2014, in Victoria alone, $70 million was lost by farmers selling to, to buyers that went broke before they were paid. Sorry, how do I move this thing around? <laughs> That's not being organised. Um, so there, there are some significant problems in the ag supply chain. Okay, so the, the big problem is that the ag supply chain is failing. Farmers don't get paid for what they deliver when they deliver. And the buyer can't get the finance they need to pay the grower for what they deliver when they deliver. And bear in mind, most buyers of grain from farmers aren't the tier one buyers you hear about, the, the, the brand names. They're the tier two, the tier three people. They're the, the vast majority of people and they cannot get flexible and just-in-time finance to pay the farmer for what they deliver when they deliver. And the third problem affects you and me as consumers. We don't know where our food comes from. The data in the ag supply chain is so fragmented, so silo-driven, that it's almost impossible, impossible to get a truthful account of where our food actually came from when it, when it came to our table. So, what's the solution? The solution is an agricultural supply chain that's embedded with digital trust. It's, we build uh, a blockchain-enabled digital commodity management platform that embeds trust through the supply chain from the consumer, from the farmer, right through to, to the consumer. Transparent trade, who bought, who sold. Auditable inventory, where's it stored, how's it been treated. Visibility of both import and export consignments. Integrated payments so that we can pay people when they deliver. Embedded finance so that we can provide the finance to the people when they need to pay the farmer. And importantly for you is the ability to aggregate all that data and display it back to you as consumers so you can finally see where your food comes from. Just how big is this market? Well, the market we operate in, in the transaction and payment security, network and market efficiency, and provenance and chain assurance in the grain and cotton industries that we operate in, it's an $18 billion market. So it's a big market. The, our vision at AgriDigital is very simple. We aim to make agricultural supply chains simple, safe, and easy and secure from the farmer right through to the consumer. So how have we been going? We launched our commercial platform in August last year, and since then we've transacted, we've got really good support from the ag community in Australia. We've transacted over 3.6 million tonnes of grain and cotton through the platform. We've got over 1,850 active users, ranging from farmers in Western Australia right through to processors in Southeast Asia, and we've transacted over $725 million of value through the platform. And the future is looking pretty bright as well. We have a blockchain protocol MVP that we're releasing in December this year. We did a number of experiments with blockchain this year uh, on provenance, uh, execution of uh, payment security on blockchains, and we're releasing that this year. We're also releasing our, our integrated blockchain platform into North America in May this year. In, in May, uh, sorry, May next year. In May this year, we launched our first supply chain finance fund, where we, we provided embedded finance to cotton growers in Australia and we're looking to roll out Fund 2 in North America next year for grain and cotton to, in Australia and, and North America. We're also doing our blockchain protocol commercial release at the end of next year. 
We've got an awesome team. We think we've got the biggest team in the world that's operating, that's experimenting on blockchain and agricultural supply chains. We're led very ably by our amazing CEO, Emma Wesson, who's in the US at the moment talking to our potential customers and speaking at a number of conferences over there. We're based in Sydney. We've got a team of about 45, roughly two thirds technical and engineering and about one third uh, commercial. So, to wrap up, we're AgroDigital. We build digital commodity management platforms for the trade, finance and traceability of global ag commodities. We're doing it for farmers, buyers, traders, elevators and consumers because the ag supply chain is failing. We have the team, the technology and the demand across the supply chain. Thank you.